Good morning, Ardmore anchors, and welcome to WAES Morning News Show. Please stop and stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stop and stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Your Ardmore anchor weather for today is cloudy with a high of 68 degrees and a 90% chance of thunderstorms. Let's see what's for breakfast and lunch. For breakfast, food variety, fresh fruit, 100% fruit juice, and milk variety. For lunch, cafe burger on a bun, turkey Italian cold cuts and cheese sub, fiesta chicken salad platter with savory crackers, emoji shaped potatoes, Tuscan kale salad, fresh grapes, and fluid milk. Remember, breakfast is free and lunch is $2.75 a day, $13.75 a week, and $55 a month. Good morning, Ardmore family. Welcome to Ardmore's Mindfulness Moment. Your PBIS thought of the day is, I never dreamed about success. I worked for it. Estee Lauder. Remember, Ardmore anchors, resilient Ardmore scholars are anchored to always be ready, be respectful, be responsible, and be an example. It is time for the Ardmore Anchor Word of the Day. Lackadaisical is an adjective meaning feeling or showing a lack of interest or enthusiasm. The sentence, I hope the medicine is not causing you to be sleepy and lackadaisical. Lackadaisical, your Ardmore Anchor Word of the Day. Your announcements for today are as follows. Today is Thursday, October 13th, 2022. Staff, please check your mailboxes and emails daily for important information from Principal Herring and school leaders. Staff, please be on your AM and PM duty post on time each day, and please sign in in the main office each day. Teachers, please send your warm body counts to the main office immediately and put your attendance in school max by 10 a.m. Grade level chairpersons, share your rolling agendas with the appropriate leadership. Staff, it is imperative that you post your required grades each week. Classroom teachers, two per subject, specialists, one per week. This will make publishing easier when the report card window opens. Attention staff and students, it is important that you remember to keep all exterior doors closed at all times and do not open any doors for anyone. Persons must enter the building by being buzzed in through the main entrance by the main office staff. Students and staff, please shut down your devices and plug them up daily so they may rest, recharge, and receive weekly IT updates, and take home your digital devices daily in case school is virtual. Attention new students and fourth graders, please sign up at www.missmcnair.com for your chance to learn an instrument this year. Miss McNair is looking for students to play clarinet, trombone, trumpet, violin, viola, and cello. It is time for Ardmore's Elementary School's fourth annual Pumpkin Book Report Literary Parade. All pumpkin projects are due before October 28th. Those are all of your announcements. Important dates this month. September 26th through October 19th, Dibbles 8 for Kindergarten 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. September 15th through October 15th, Hispanic Heritage Month. October 10th through the 14th, National School Lunch Week. October 12th, Department Collaborative Planning. October 14th, Ardmore's first annual ESA night at 6 p.m. October 17th, Readathon fundraiser kickoff assemblies. October 18th, Fall Picture Day. October 19th, Leadership Team Meeting and Anti Bullying Awareness Day. Everyone wear orange. October 21st, Professional Development. There will be no school for students. October 24th through the 28th will be Ardmore's Fall Spirit Week. October 28th will be Ardmore's fourth annual book report literary parade was all of your important dates okay ardmore family it is time for ardmore's fall spirit week monday october 24th breast cancer awareness wear something pink tuesday october 25th domestic violence awareness wear something purple wednesday the 26th celebrate life and live drug free wear something red Thursday, the 27th, National Bullying Prevention and Unity Day. Wear something orange. And Friday, the 28th, Hunger and Homeless Awareness. Wear something green. So students, please make sure that you know from the 24th through the 28th is Ardmore's Fall Spirit Week. Now for Ardmore's Hispanic Heritage Moment. N.T. Ramey. On the winter solstice, there is a big celebration in South America. It is time to celebrate N.T. Ramey. Inti Raymi is a festival that began during the Inca Empire. The Inca Empire was an ancient empire in South America. The Incas worshipped the sun god, Inti. 
Each year on the winter solstice, the Incas celebrate Inti with this festival. Today, native people who live in the Andes Mountains celebrate Inti Raymi. They carry on the Inca traditions. Long ago, the Inca leader performed a religious ceremony for Inti Raymi. He thanked the sun for its blessings. Now actors perform this ceremony for a large audience. Some actors wear traditional clothing. Some people take part in large parades. People in these parades thank the sun for the life it brings. Inti Raimi celebrates the sun and the traditions of people who have lived in these areas for over a thousand years. Inti Raimi, our Hispanic Heritage Moment. Please raise your right hand and let's recite our school pledge. A one, two, a one, two, three. I pledge today to do my best in reading math and all the rest. I promise to obey the rules in my class and in the school. I'll respect myself and others too. I'll expect the best in all I do. I am here to learn all I can, to try my best to be all I am, to try my best to be all I am. Word. Tune in next time for our news on WAES. WAES is signing off. Everyone have a great, great day.